Hi everyone, Lewis here, and I thought I'd bring you some recent news related to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. I do apologize for the lack of these videos as of late. Things in life, including my mental well-being, have been the reasons why. But I'm back, and I'm here to tell you Niantic has given us a lot. And we're going to start with the new Community Day. And that is Poplio, which will be on Saturday, August 31st, 2024, from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. local time. Poplio will appear more frequently in the wild if you evolve its evolution Brynony into Pre-Marina, it will learn the move Hydro Cannon. And after the event and during, you can also teach it the move Sparkling Aria. There will also be a special research story for one dollar or the equivalent pricing tier in your local currency. As of this recording, it is not live and we don't know what the story will be, but the event for bonuses include two times candy for catching Pokemon, three times XP for catching Pokemon, three times chance for trainers level 31 and up to receive XL candy from catching Pokemon, lore modules activated during the event will last for three hours, incense excluding the daily venture incense activated during the event will last for three hours. Take up the five snapshots during community day for a photobomb encounter with Poplio. One additional special trade can be made for the maximum of three for the day. Trades will require 50% less Stardust and Bryony will appear in four star raids after Community Day. If you complete the raid near the gym where it took place at, Pop Leo will spawn and you'll get another chance to catch a shiny. Also announced Pikachu's Indonesia Journey which will cost about 150 rupees and the Pokemon featured for this event are Bulbasaur, Charmander, Charizard, Squirtle, Flying Pikachu with the multicolored balloons as well as special balloons, Pikachu wearing a back cadet shirt Jigglypuff, Caterpie, Magikarp, Gyarados, Eevee, Gligar, Mantine, Drifloon, Bronzog, Chatot, Noibat, Rollet, and Mermini will all be available as shinies. All the Cantonian starters will also appear in one star raids, while Charizard, Gyarados, and Dragonite will be in three star raids. And Mega Latios and Mega Latias will return as part of Mega Raids. And of course, if you evolve Ivysaur into Venusaur, it will learn the move Frenzy Plant, just like it did on Community Day. Same goes with Charmeleon Charizard for Blast Attack and War Total for Blastoids with Hydro Cannon. In other Pokemon news, we got Ultra Unlock bonuses for completing Go Fest. We will get Mega Lucario Raid Day, which will be this coming Saturday on July 27th, 2024, from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. local time. Mega Lucario will be appearing in a lot of raids. The feature attack will be Force Palm. And you'll be able to catch its shiny form, too. Togetomaru 
will appear as a shiny and, and another ultra unlock bonus which will start Thursday July 25th at 10 a.m. to Tuesday July 30th 2024 8 p.m. local time which by the time this video is up the event will likely have already been started you will get a Lowland Sand True, Magnemite, Pineco, Nose Pass, Aeron, Beldum, Bronzor, Pharosee, Galarian, Stumpfisk, and Toga Tomorrow, Onyx, Scyther, Skarmory, and Clink. All are available as Shinies. And some of these Pokemon will also appear in 1 Star Raids, and for 3 Star Raids, Steelix, Scizor, Mawile, and Agaron. They will also be available as Shinies. There will also be field research tasks, a timed research event, which is free, along with collection challenges, Pokestop showcases, and there will also be a couple of Safari Zones. One in Jakarta, Indonesia, for the weekend of September 21st through the 22nd from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. local time with the cost of 125,000 rap rapida and the Pokemon that will be spawning for this event will be Eevee with an Explorer hat and you can evolve it into all of its evolutions from Kanto to Kalos. And just like the Pikachu's Journey event, the two Pikachu variants will also be available for this, in addition to the final evolutions of the Cantonian starters and, and so forth. And you'll also be able to catch some of the region exclusives as Shinies, and Skidoo will be back. And it'll also be coming to Ichion, South Korea, where you'll get a Pikachu variant with the Safari hat, and other Pokemon, and Skidoo will also be available. It will cost you about 11,000 won. One more thing. I have exciting news. I'll be going for my Patty Advanced Mermaid next week. And I couldn't be more excited. Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Threads, Twitch, TikTok, and Facebook. And remember, it's time for adventure.